So how did I become a Yankee fan? Uh, just from my dad, really, just growing up. He always had the games on, whether it was Phil Rizzuto and Bill White on TV or Frank Messer on the radio, and it just became a tradition. We started going to games as far as back as 1983, and I've just carried on my fandom and the tradition ever since. My first game, yeah, it was in 1983, and I was standing in the outfield during batting practice, and I was looking for Dave Winfield. I'm yelling out to him. I didn't see him. So my dad's like, I don't see him. We were in right field. He's like, keep an eye on this kid here, number 46. His name is Madden. He's going to be real good someday. And then just from that day on, I was yelling his name. Then he turned around and made eye contact with me, and then just from then, I was hooked. And to this day, he's still my favorite. I follow his whole career. I just met him at American Dream Mall about two and a half months ago. Got my picture with him, an autograph, and he was just really nice. My mom's favorite player was Mickey Rivers, and she still loves him to this day. In fact, one of my friends goes to the Yankee fantasy camp, and he actually had him, Mickey Rivers sign a picture to my mom this past January, and I gave it to her in March when I saw her, and she loved it. And then uh, just with my dad, just really, he used to love talking about Casey Stengel and about how just the way he would manage and how he would uh, let a starting pitcher know that he was pitching that day. He would just put a ball in his shoe, and that would be like the pitcher knowing that he got to his locker. Oh, I'm pitching today. So that always stuck with me. And that was our second edition of our new feature, My Yankee Way. Stories of how fans earn their pinstripes. If you'd like to be featured on an upcoming episode, email us at features at yesnetwork.com.